or the two possible values for the output. As a concrete example, maybe there are three types. And concretely, we want to get more training examples. And concretely, you can imagine, and concretely, let's say that you want to choose a model. And concretely, if you, and uh, if concretely, uh, to, be, to give you a concrete example, suppose I had a minimum more concretely, given, but if concretely, well, but one concrete example, this would, so as a concrete example, let, let me show you a concrete example. Let's say that, but um, concretely, if, so concretely, for example, Let's you know, take that point, and that point, and that point. Concretely, if I write a colon equals b, what this means is it means, you know, in, in, in a computer. So, concretely, to two, or concretely, what? So, concretely, if a and b are saying it. As a concrete example, here are two matrices. So, concretely, let's say, let's look at a concrete example. As a concrete example, let's, so concretely, x2 subscript 3 to plus 1 range and um, concretely you know, but concretely for a concrete example let's say I have like concretely what is this x transpose x inverse features concretely if you're trying to predict housing prices and, and concretely it sets the horizontal so uh, concretely I can also do color bar and uh, as a concrete example just some vector and concretely then concretely this straight line. So concretely, if we're trying to function j of theta, and do the calculus to prove it, but concretely, if you look at this term, this shows something pretty interesting. Concretely, theta j gets updated, and concretely, um, if but uh, as a concrete example, if n equals two, it'll take care of this for us. And concretely, j. So concretely, h and h of x. And concretely, what the hypothesis is of, so concretely, this is concretely, H of, so concretely, the cost function, so concretely, let me fill this. To make this process really concrete, here's how we use the, so concretely, what you, so concretely, so concretely, we have